again Hey guys, what's up? Anyways guys, I'm coming back with another video. Anyways guys, today I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit about what stuff I use for YouTube. But before I start guys, please go check out my YoloMinecraft.com uh, server trailer. I worked really hard on getting it all set up. Uh, I got an editor to edit him. Uh, I'll put his link in the description. He does amazing work. And uh, anyways guys, uh, please go support that. Uh, it took us a long time and I'm very proud of it and I just want it to grow. So anyways, without further ado, here we go. So, like I said, today we're going to be talking about what gear I use for YouTube. So, because, uh, see, I've had a lot of people message me because I'm um, not bragging or anything, but my picture, uh, my videos do look uh, pretty good. Um, and you don't see that a lot with a channel my size because um, I made the decision when I started a YouTube channel that I wanted to get good, equi uh, good equipment to be sure to uh, make my content uh, very enjoyable to see. So... Anyways, guys, right now uh, what you guys are seeing is a Hapog HD PVR2. Uh, that's what I use to record this with. So if you guys like that picture, um, also another little thing is, guys, uh, people are always saying HD PVR versus Elgato, um, and I do know a little bit about that. And from what I can tell, is it's complicated. HD PVR does have a better, uh, better sorry uh software and it has a, a better picture no it does not have a better software my apologies it has better picture that's what i meant to say um elgato um with their stuff it's more dull um not hating on elgato at all i love uh, elgato too but um yeah their picture is more dull and not so uh not so in-depth i guess would be a good word for it so i would recommend an HTTP vr and I have both an Elgato and an HTTP VR. The only thing I don't like about the HTTP VR is the um, software for it that comes with it uh, standardly. Because right now I use the standard HTTP VR software and then I uh, bring it over to my uh, PC recording area. Anyways, guys, uh, that's what I use for Xbox. And, um, yeah. <coughs> Alright. So, what I use for PC is I use a number of programs. Um, I have a bunch of PC recording programs for sure, but I mainly use. It's hard to say honestly, but I would say I my favorite's Camtasia Studio. The only issue is um, its price, but I may or may not have torrented. Wink, wink, cough, cough. Um, so yeah, uh, I use Camtasia about ninety percent of the time. Other times I'll use programs like fraps but i rarely use that unless my camtasia is just acting up that day so yeah and then the stuff i use to edit with is i use uh sony vegas uh, pro 12 that also may or may not be torrented wink wink cough cough <laughs> um yeah and then that's basically what i use um to record my stuff with and what i use for my microphone is i use a blue yeti with a pop filter and a microphone stand well actually i don't have my pop filter or microphone stand yet uh, I'm going to be getting that in a couple days, so hopefully you guys will see a difference and maybe uh, convince you guys to go buy a Yeti with a uh, with a pop filter and a microphone stand. I do I do love this Yeti. Um, so yeah, uh, that pretty much does it for today's video. Anyways, guys, again, go show my other video um, some support. I'll probably link in the description, and you'll see it in my outro. Anyways, guys, till next time, peace out.